Hey folks, welcome back to another video of Super Mario Odyssey. <coughs> In the last video, we he took a so quick trip to the Ruined Kingdom that I decided to go oh, oh, over to Bowser's Kingdom and collect some more moons from this kingdom. But we didn't go for the moon rock. So, we had the only one purple coin left. And the moon rocks, we're gonna do that one. Although, I'm not gonna go to the moon kingdom in this video. Just because. <laughs> so, it's just doing it as a special location for the previous one. Ah, we just can skip it. And as you can see, we got a lot to cover. Actually, yes, we got no, a total of, wait a minute, let's see now, 17 more moons. Aha, there's one right next to First moon. I think those are koi's or carps, actually. Not quite sure. From crates in the moat. Hmm. They look a bit like koi's. Or are they carps? Carps look like this too. Well, the mighty carp never looks in different patterns unless it's a shiny one. Although they did, but probably basing on, but that's probably what the magic carp and magic carp jump were focused on. But we're not talking about the app. Back the way we came. Now let's see. Nothing. Call how you did that one. That's a bit interesting, I never thought of doing that. You can do sort of like a spin like in Galaxy. Successful first shot. second jump and that was actually quite the uneasy mi hit boss well would it be considered a mid boss I'd say sort of but at those creatures are mid bosses invader at about in Bowser's castle so I'm guessing they're named invaders but I'm not completely sure
Yes, sir. And it was a bit tricky. Although I think it's actually possible to make it a bit easier if you were to use, of course, two player. Oh wait, now I think I recall how you were supposed to do it. But first, there was something else. Because if you can sit, notice there's a key over there. Ouch. Failure. <coughs> well, now that I've actually completed the moon in the, in the Snow Kingdom, it shouldn't be too tricky to 100% now. Of course, the final moon will be probably the trickiest. But that's without saying. But I'm not gonna spoil it for those who don't know. Notice how the, the those things disappear once more. Leave this form. Okay, that didn't work out. How could I crash into uh, to the flag part? How are they even floating in the first place? Now back the way we came. That was a close one. I'm guessing problems are somewhat connected. Hey, hey. the power stars because they. They have all power in their names, and that's well, they make the, the same sounds. And those are seemingly used in power moons on t for and power stars for to power some things. Okay, that was pointless. Because according to this, it says there's none. Oh yeah, now I remember. I had to push the... Aha! Uh -huh. Perfect shot.
inside a block at the gate. Super awesome move. Wait, what's that at the end over there? Oh yeah, that's a cannibal. This uh, it looked like it was some weird creature. Oh, that was a quick. That was a speed running tactic. If I, I guess. That was bad grammar as well. I think that's actually the only up pipe in this entire game. Well, in 3D at least. Spawning bird. It seems like there's something above it, but I can't seem to notice it. That was very quick way up. I'm talking like a stump. Caveman. Easy peasy. <sighs> Climb the wooden tower. And I'm figuring the most maybe the purple coin. Because I have no idea where that's gonna be. No other pieces here. So, if we just toss it... I can fly! Why do I end up there? I'm guessing those kites are coming from somewhere high up, and I'm pretty sure they are kites, yes. This is one of the few instances where to get of paratroopers being playable. It's a bit of a shame that they're not so much capturable enemies. I wish regular drivers may have been here. It would have been interesting to see how they would have been. They could have maybe been like, they could dismantle themselves in order to hide it themselves similar to like how bow acts in Paper Mario uh, of course Paper Mario and Vivian acts in Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door 
Or just Boo Mario. Oh, that's another thing. Boo, square day in this game. My control is vibrating, I'm not quite sure what's causing that. Thank you. And there it goes. It's still vibrating. I wonder how many unused concepts they had for Odyssey. I tried looking that on the Mario wiki, but it said nothing about that. Which is a bit of a shame. I wonder if they had any plans for the costumes to have special abilities. Because, to be honest, that would have been a bit cool. I know some of the clothes have some special teas that they can do. But not very many. That's all the moons on this part of this area. Here's Kingdom Timer Challenge number two. I didn't even have Cappy with me right then. Master Cup for this place. I believe they come actually immediately after you completed an area, but.
This is going extremely well. I don't see any way I can kill this, but I shouldn't say that because... Well, many people know what happens to people in books or TV or movies when they say that bad things happen. Huh! That's a... like 10 seconds faster than previously. My long jump technique works very effectively. <clears throat> also, if, if you may be wondering when you look at the dates... Yes, I'm recording this when my pre previous video is uploaded pretty much. Yeah, because I had a little I forget thing when I accidentally failed to published the video when it was supposed to, so now I'm uploading videos of it at the schedule, so that gives me a little bit of advantage. No. But that's not important anyways. So where is... Caught on the giant horn. Why is Bowser so focused on himself? I mean, well, he is the great and glorious Koopa King. We could save. Even though I will have collected all the moons, I'm going to have to collect all the purple coins because that's part of 100% thing. There's a key somewhere. Those bunnies don't are, are afraid of falling, it seems. Because they can't fall. I'm not gonna make a pun with that. Where is it? Aha! No, 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 no. Shoot. Why are we saying why anyways? It's not like we're Wario or Waluigi. Sorry about that. Anyways. So I've... So, I'm guessing that electric line will take us where we want to go. Stonewall Circuit. That wasn't a racetrack at all! What 
think this is Mario Kart? I know Mario's floating slightly. Wait, is he? Yes, he is. He's floating in midair. Hmm, there's some moon somewhere out on that line. According to this. Didn't realize he could respawn that. Mm. Oh, I forgot the name of the bird again. on the head to did it. Ignore that word rear in that sentence. It's not buttocks. I shouldn't even be mentioning stuff like that. Oh that was an effective method. That was a close one. Taking notes on the wall. Three more of these remain actually. Aha, uh -huh, that's it. Oh my gosh, that's where the purple coin is. Well, at least I now know where the final purple coin is. Behind the a tall wall, poke, poke. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. There we go. And now we only need to get two more. Oh no! I nearly grandpa'd my way. What the? I just went in between its feet! That's like if you're gonna be charged 
punched by a giant, but then he managed to manage to dodge just in time. But then it just so happens that he goes straight through you. Well, just straight over you because he's so big. So wait, that's the third courtyard front, but this is the first courtyard, isn't it? Where's the second one? I'm just gonna double check because I don't recall. It's nice how these breathe fire. One may wonder where Bowser is actually. Because as we saw in the ending of Super Mario Odyssey, Mario. You know, defeated. Well, was it? Her and he and Peach went back home. More pretty much abandoned. Was it? So where did Bowser end up? Maybe he... I'm not gonna be too harsh, but maybe he just died? On the moon? But that's a bit harsh to say. I wonder if some people actually believe... I think... Here I said. But no, in the people of the world, at least one person probably, probably does. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna sneak here for the top. Ah, shoot. You say still. Here it is again. Now let's try to go extra slow. What do you see here? Just a moose with horns. Or is it just a red hedgehog? Okay, I need to get it within this range here. That way you can't escape. It's back. Ah, oh, I missed. I missed. something to do with Japanese folklore or something. Considering all that there are a lot of stuff like that in Mario get in Nintendo games. Okay. Careful. Not to cross the perimeter, right? Shoot. And I failed. Okay, I'm needing to change. It's just 
scared for the bird. Look at the Odyssey, it's very well changed. Let's see, what is very bird friendly? I know. Pirates. After all, birds sit on pirates' shoulders. Oh, this other skull on the pirate hat that Mario wears is actually the symbol that's on a blood bill. Oh! Well, um. Great jump. Ouch. Now I'm just being clumsy. Okay, by the edge of that final bird, I'll try to catch it. Missed. This reminds me sort of like on, in Kirby games how, like, if you leave the screen, the enemies will respawn if you come back. This is silly, I'm losing to a bird. Finally. Small bird in Bowser's castle. Well, that's everything you actually that you can do in Bowser's kingdom. Well, um, of 100%ation that is. I suppose we even have Jizzo statues. I wonder why he wants this. Why does this castle change a lot? Now, although I could end this video, I don't want to do it that quite yet. Because we actually got access to probably the one of the most effective places to collect money in the entire game. As I probably mentioned a few times before, but I don't recall right now. And we have had access to it for quite some time. Although it doesn't give up the most coins in the world at once, it's one. It's probably so well used because it's one of the fastest ones. Huh. Interesting. Spinies can't stand spikes, despite that's what they focus on. Never seen that before. Unless it was just suffocation death.
I'm gonna do it a few times. So I can increase our money count so we can purchase some more clothes. See that? We went from like 125 to 400. Alright. Well, now we have 400, you can see exactly how much we can get. I know there's some better ways to gain money, but. People like this way, and I've done it myself for my practice run. I'm not gonna get all the special clothes. I probably need to do that for myself rather than do that because I wouldn't say that would count as 100% thing. Oh shoot, I didn't get to see. Well, I got about 165 from that. And I'm gonna go just go to Crit Caps and see what I could purchase with this. Not really a big point. I'll probably do this a bit off screen a bit later on. Actually, I think you can get the doctor's cap and that did the come out, which you can see there. Here, quite easily by using amiibos. However, and so with Warrior. However, not Waluigi because I don't think Waluigi actually has this on amiibo. Yes, it got expensive. And these clothes have gone up to a high expense. The zombie outfits total is 8,000. I wonder if you could actually gain those before you arrived. These aren't specials. So the final result is I did the Kong with a Mario heart hat. Mario hat with Mario. Hmm, there's something about Mario's hair. Yeah. So anyways, we've now explored <laughs> the entirety of Bowser's kingdom. Later on, so I think what you're gonna do is do Luigi's Balloon World.
Okay, so basically what happened was that I failed to do complete that task, but I figured out how to raise my rank. It's a cheap method, but it's very easy. All I have to just do is just to to find the easiest moons and then balloons. Get many in a row. Don't mess up, and you'll manage to get every. <laughs> a lot of coins. So this is the... I guess you could say that this is the superior method of gaining coins. Wait, what? That was a close one. So we're gonna do some Luigi's Balloon World instead. See now I caught the four in a row, and when you and you can rank up quickly with this as well. So as you see now, I'm on 4,000. There it is. In fact, just a while off screen, there was one that was extremely, was so close that I, it took not even a second. And we're also hiding a balloon. I think I see it. Yep, that's definitely the balloon. There we go. Congrats. Also, it's now when this. By the time this video will be uploaded. Yeah, I went up a rank. By the po time this video will be uploaded. The Pokemon. The next Pokemon game will be out. Pokemon, let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee. Which is going to be exciting. I'm going to get Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. Although I already played Pokemon Yellow on the Virtual Console. But we're not going to talk about Pokemon.
<laughs> Just in time for the 10 second countdown. And look, now that we just free balloons. See the balloon. I wonder how Bowser actually became king of the Koopas. Was it like a fight of the biggest and strongest? <laughs> Was his father? Or, or king of the Koopas as well? Or did he fight for <laughs> becoming king? This is a very effective method. Congrats. Whoa, my rank's raising fast. Doesn't those Japanese people are always so good. Why do you think they got the lost look? Well, <laughs> Sorry about that, got it interrupted. Last second. Whoa. Yeah. Oh no. Now I know at least where the balloon was supposed to be. Streak lost, but still, I'm very impressed with myself. Well, I've done very well. I think I can go all the way up to the shop now. Because these quits are only used on one thing in this game. My balloon's doing quite well. So I can buy back. Yes, Warrior spent all his money to get a gold cap. 
actually going to collect a bit more money. So they can do Luigi's Balloon World later on. But that was a very productive trip. Also, I'd like to point out something. Mario... <laughs> when Luigi's Balloon World gets to the max rank, Luigi will actually get gold balloons. Or I'm I think that's what I recall seeing. I don't know if I'll be able to do that myself. So, left button is for placing balloons in Balloon World. Down button is for camera stop. And up by the D-pad. Left button, eh. the right button is for amiibos, but what is the top up button for? It has no function whatsoever. Also, I've seen that trailer for the update for Kirby Star Allies. Those are from the most recent ones. I'm doing quite well with my balloon things. Sometimes I wonder how hard it is to make these games, and it's of course taken a long time. However, <laughs> what happened with that E.T. video game was what made it so bad. How long much time they had to make the game and all that stuff. It's a pretty much the worst selling video game of all time. But that but ET is not the main focus. Take one more trip before I'll try a little more Luigi's Balloon World. Because it seems as you go up in rank, they get trickier. Was easy.
Oh my gosh, that was so close. Congrats. Uh-huh. Come on. Come on. That was easy. It's a very perfected long jump and you can get that one. I nearly got enough to... Wait a minute... Where is that? Okay, I failed this one. Let me see. Where is it? I can't pinpoint where it is. Oh. Well, all good things come to an end. I just quickly see where.
it's very close. Oh, clever. Hiding it just underneath that. Somebody seemingly tried to mimic it, but failed. A little more and I will have completed it. Just a little more. You can see Cappy's eyes closed, apparently. That's okay. I mean, we've done very well. So, fu possibly final trip to Crazy Cap. For the moment. I'm saying that because I'm not... We won't... Well, at least not around the money area. I get a polygonized little Mario. And there you have it. So now we've completed mainly the entire her Bowser's kingdom and of all the regular clothes. And aren't as special. So, our next kingdom to visit, we're going back to the Moon Kingdom. So, thanks for watching. Like or subscribe. And if you want me to try something out, let me know in the comments. You can't see how interested Mario is because he doesn't have a mouth for her eyes. There's the moon. And look what's new there. Huh, kept his face is echoing. But anyways, thanks for watching.